Secretary of State Mike Pompeo could be in some hot water after his recent string of visits to Kansas. KSNT's Capitol Bureau reporter Corinne Griffith explains the situation. Democratic Senator Robert Menendez of New Jersey is asking for a review of Pompeo's trips to Kansas, saying they could be in violation of the Hatch Act. The Hatch Act is a law that says federal employees are not allowed to campaign for office while working a federal job. It's been speculated that Pompeo's recent visits to Kansas are a sign that he plans to run for the U.S. Senate. But Pompeo has not announced a campaign. Our political analyst Bob Beatty says Pompeo could still be in violation of the Hatch Act. You don't have to be running for office. You can be laying the groundwork to be running for office. So under an interpretation of the Hatch Act, you can just be doing campaign-like activities to prepare to run, and you could be violating it. Beatty says Pompeo's latest visit to Wichita with Ivanka Trump was likely one of the major causes behind this review. He says visiting local businesses and schools and talking with potential voters is more the job of someone running a campaign than that of the Secretary of State. But of course, these are only allegations at this time. At the Capitol, I'm Corinne Griffith. And this isn't the first time that a Kansan has been under review. Former Governor of Kansas, or former Governor Kathleen Sebelius, that is, of Kansas, was found to have violated the Hatch Act while a member of President Obama's cabinet.